Yep. That's how cold it is. What are we doing here? We're making dust. That's what we're doing. You can't see it on the camera, of course, because it doesn't pick up the dust in the air, but I found the solution to the belt problem. I went through a belt every two minutes. 36 grit, made in USA, open coat, garbage. Went through five belts, just a few minutes, junk. And I found the solution to the problem. All the way around the room, except for one inch in the corner, right there. I went to the big box Lowe's last night to try find the solution to sanding in the corners. Well, it'd be nice if I had some 24 grit sandpaper to go in my belt sander. But nobody local has it. It's three bucks a sheet. One guy has free shipping, but he's away for three days. Another place wants three fifty a sheet for one of these. So I bought some anyways. Let's see. 36 grit, extra coarse, world's best sandpaper, Norton, Norton abrasive, zirconia alumina. And it is made in Hejo on Uu, USA. Well, they make the printing small enough. Saint. Oh, I need some extra light for my old eyeballs. Saint Cobain S A I N T dash C O B I N Saint Cobain Abrasives Inc. Do it yourself slash contractor marketing group. Stephenville, Texas. Saint Cobain Abrasives. Norton. So I bought a bunch of these belts. And they cost Norton belts ten dollars for five belts, two bucks a belt, which is cheap, just as cheap as Amazon and eBay. I wanted the 24 grit. Only get it online, and you got to wait. And I can't wait. I need it now. So I kept poking around the aisle, just looking at different things, thinking floppy disks or something, floppy flippy floppies, and Norton sells this, the 5 inch angle grinder sander conversion kit, more flexible than a grinding wheel, outlasts conventional paper discs 10 to 1. Now what's interesting is most of the grinders sold for residential slash light commercial use are 4.5 inch, just like this one, 4.5 inch, and I've had lots of grinders, Craftsman, and Tooltech, and DeWalt. Oops, I ran out of memory. Anyway, so the grinders are four and a half inch. I've had Metabos, you name it. The best ones are the $5 ones from Lowe's. Yeah, regular 30 bucks on clearance for $5. Anyways, this is a Sears Craftsman. When you put the trigger on lock, after 30 seconds it unlocks, PIA. So I tried their conversion. It includes a nut without a tool. So I use my needle nose pliers as a tool. It includes two 50 grit discs, and I don't know why they chose 50. Aluminum oxide made in safety warning where I face and body protection whilst grinding. Yep, two 50s. I wonder why they give you 50s. Why do they choose 50s? Made in, I want to show you where it's made, it's important. Everything here is dusty and there's frost in the air, man. I gotta bring a big heater in here. There's gonna be frost on the pumpkin tonight. We're going down to the cold temperatures. Do not exceed 12,000 RPM. Made in Canada. Fabrique au Canada. Hejo on Canada. Yep. Imported by Saint Gobain. G O B A I N. Abrasives Canada Inc. Why would it be imported if it's made in Canada? I guess it's just your typical form letter sticker. So anyways, I didn't use the 50 disc. I went right to the 36 grit, even though they have a 24 grit. And these discs are three in a pack and they cost $12 or Backup pad was $10 for the pad gizmo. They had a 7 inch that was 20. This was $10.50. And uh, 
Norton backup pad, Norton 5 inch fiber dish, 24 grit, 12 bucks, $4 each. That's a lot of money for one disc. But the proof's in the pudding. And I'll put a new disc on because I hit some real crud here. It was thick and rich. Let me ground it down real deep. We've got some action there with a the Dodge truck. I guess he's got free gas. So you just go around the room and it goes right up to the mop boards. And if you got some depressions here with some goopy, you just grind into it. And you can't really see it there, but there's quite the depression on the floor there. But whatever, it's where the foot of the radiator was sitting. We got some rot here. It's rotten. Ooh, change the station. They got the radio playing in leather here. Don't tell anybody. So it does a great job. It goes right around the pipe. It just fits in here. I squeeze around and press in there and it's a bit of a mess. You can't really see it, but it's a bit of a mess behind there. I've got some gouge marks, but I'll live. But uh, see all this stuff here? Huge swirl marks from the edger, they call it, that you have to rent and bring it back and paper is expensive. So I use my little grinder. It's a lot easier. You can manipulate it better, but you can't lean on it. Oh, got a fight here. Kids with skateboards. Why are some skateboards so loud and some so quiet that their bearings worn out? Need some fluid film? Yeah, I get paid every time I say that. So, with one disc, one $4 disc, I did from there, all the way around the radiator, what do we got here? Six, seven feet, 10 feet, four meters, three, four meters. Did probably 25, 30 feet all the way around here, all the way down here. And the disc was burning out around here. It's starting to get clogged and slowing down. So I think that I can do the rest of this place with three, four, five discs total. All this, all this, all this, all the way around. Yep. All the way around and back to the point of the beginning, which is right there. It's 3 o'clock, it's Wednesday afternoon. I went to the barber, Barbette. It's a female barber, a Barbette. A Barbie. Barbie. Barbie the barber. The Barbette. Went to the barber hairstylist this morning, paid $12, had whatever hair I have left cut, and had my beard trimmed, so I look less like a Santa Claus. And who's the old guy in the mirror? Should I paint behind the radiator? I don't know. It's stylish and heavy. There's a black mark, probably where she stood next to the window for 50 years. Got out of her chair, maybe, or leaned over for something. I don't know, no furniture when my friend bought the place. So that's the deal. Don't rent the edger. Buy the conversion kit for your grinder. 10 bucks and buy some 36 grit. It's more than enough. Even the 50 might do it if your goopy paint and varnish ain't too thick. <laughs> 10 bucks for a haircut. <laughs> no more breath. Keeps me warm, actually. All right, I'm not going to make very long of a video, but I'm going to show you change hands what this thing does. Made in Canada. Crack her up!
What a dusty mess. Oh yeah. Better not misspell it. Oops. Almost misspelled it. Corvair Wild. All right, I'm gonna put this camera in the kitchen because this place is dusty. And I've got a dust mask on, a good one. And it's chilly in here. Chilly, chilly, chilly. Oh, turn the burners on. Just what we need. Get away. <laughs>